G'day guys and welcome to another episode of Ballerine Life. Today I'm here with Kay and Chilla at Brewery Colo, Ocean Grove's newest brewery right here in the industrial estate of Ocean Grove. Guys, thanks for having me. Thanks, thanks Kay. Now tell us a little bit about the whole history and story of creating a brewery in Ocean Grove. It originally started in Brisbane way back now in my uni days. Yep. Um, Three other mates, we decided we wanted to open a bar by the time we hit 30. Yeah. Um, that never happened. Everyone's dream, I've yeah, been the bar. <laughs> and um, so, next best thing, I thought, oh, well, why not a beer? And yep. So, sort of having a chat with Kay, we started up the Brewery Colo and yep. sort of that, and then it's just sort of developed from there. Just growing wind yeah, and taken off. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah, awesome. And Kay, you've been enjoying it, it's really started to blossom. Yeah, it's really good. We, um, it's tough work, yep. a lot of hard work, but um, we're enjoying it yep. and the, watching the development and the beer and um, the community support has just been fantastic, so we're really enjoying it. Yeah, and you grew up in Ocean Grove, Kate? I did, yeah. yeah. So I was born and bred in Ocean Grove, yeah. moved away for a couple of years, yeah. like most people, yeah. and then now back here with a, a young family and the community business. So it's basically just a mum and dad operation with the two of you operating the whole system. How does that all work out? Um, well, Kay runs the operations, she's the business mind behind it. Yeah. Um, I brew and maintenance and everything else sort of the manual labour in the place and you get as much family as possible yeah, yeah. local in the area so, to come out and yeah. help as much as think, possible i don't think we could have gone yeah. as far or yeah. progressed as much as we could have yeah. uh, without family yeah. so yeah it's been yeah. a really great help awesome yeah we've got a builder in the family a plumber a lot of um, hands on deck so it's been great yeah. yeah and they're all local trades that work in the town as well yeah, yeah. so it's keeping it really local yeah. it definitely yeah, is. yeah. cool that's no, very good so you also use a couple of local um, ingredients to the Ballerine Peninsula. Yeah, so in um, one of our beers, um, we use Ballerine Apries. Yep. Uh, it's a hibiscus honey and uh, lime beer. Yep. And you're using someone from Love Tea as well? Yeah, Love Tea. So the hibiscus tea leaves come from Love Tea yep. out of um, South Geelong, which yep. are local as well. Yep. Um, and we also have uh, food trucks here as well, regularly, um, that are local, yep, generally local. local food trucks. Well. Yeah. And you've got a little bit of an environmental conscious as well. You're, you're sort of supporting a few different causes and you're doing a little bit of a recycling program at the moment. Yeah, so um, our spent grain that we that comes out of the, the brewing process, uh, we give that away um, to a local farmer who's supporting the drought, uh, drought effect farmers in New South Wales. Yep. Um, he looks after a lot of their calves from up there. And, yep. um, I just We just sort of give them some grain to help out along and yep. yeah, it goes well. So Chilla, tell us quickly about the process of how many beers you're making or how many kegs you're putting out per week and, and the support where you're getting all that from and where you're sending it to. Uh, yep, so we've got, at the moment we've got six beers on tap. Yep. Um, looking to progress that to eight. Yep. Uh, we've got a few ideas about some festival beers in the process. Um, but yeah, everything's sort of done here. Yeah. Um, yeah. And how many sort of kegs roughly do you think you're making uh, so each batch here that we brew yep. is a thousand litres. So, yep. so a, each one of those. Yep, it's a thousand litre solid. brew house. Yep. Uh, that's a twenty, it's 20 kegs or 136 cans. So you're supplying beer to local venues as well? To yep. a few local um, bottle shops, cafes, restaurants, things like that. And we also have uh, takeaways here as well. Yeah, so awesome. Can come in so you can come along, grab a six pack, take off, take it home, call in for a beer, whatever you like. Yeah. And what are your sort of opening hours? So we're, at the moment, we're Thursday, Friday afternoons, evenings, and Saturday and Sundays. Yeah, awesome. Nice. And the rest of that time, I suppose, is brewing time. Yeah. Monday through to Wednesday. Yeah, yeah good. Uh, yeah, brewing days. Yeah. yeah, awesome. So there you have it, guys. Brewery Colo, located in Marine Parade in the industrial estate, open Thursdays to Sundays. If you want to come down and wet the whistle, I really guarantee you'll have a great time. Oh, 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 oh,